Hi everyone, it's Random Design, and finally with another case modeling project. This time we work together with MSI to promote their new B450 Tomahawk motherboard series. Searching for ideas, we came across this new Venom movie, which will be released soon. And we got so excited about the style of the movie that we thought, what could be better than turning this awesome character into a case mod? So have fun watching the making of. This time I started with a 3D model, which I found on Thingiverse. I made all adjustments in Cinema 4D until I liked the final look. I removed the teeth, which will be printed separately. For 3D printing, the template was splitted as shown here for the tongue. The individual pieces were transferred into readable G-code files and printed with my Cinto 3DVox 2X. Afterwards, I sanded all pieces and resembled them using superglue. All gaps were filled with spot putty and after another round of sanding, I covered everything with spray filler. To assemble the body, which is supposed to carry most of the weight, I cut and included short metal pins. They also helped to perfectly align the individual parts. Smaller gaps were filled with super glue and sanded down. The same was done for the head. Larger gaps were filled and remodeled with two-part epoxy putty like Milliput or body filler like Bondo. All pieces were again sanded and then I used wet sanding to make the surface perfectly smooth. After coating everything with spray filler, I wet sanded the surface again and again and again. When everything was smooth and even, I colored Venom with black glossy spray paint to achieve the characteristic wet and slimy look. While the paint was drying, I started to build a base for the mod. The panels were cut from MDF and glued together. I fixed the whole construction with duct tape for drying. The base should get a chalkboard-like look, so it was painted with black gesso, sanded down after drying to make it look scratched and used. I also designed and 3D printed the Venom letters. After sanding, I installed again short metal pins, which allow attaching them to the base. I installed SMD LEDs to the backside, which should highlight the letters. Besides, I built a mounting for the motherboard, which should go into the back of Venom. I already drilled in all holes required for my custom water cooling. All water cooling parts were kindly provided by Alphacool. This time I went for soft tubes, since they will enter Venom's body and should look like injection loops filled with actual Venom. Therefore, I've chosen green opaque as a liquid coolant. I sleeved all cables in black and green to match the overall color design. Finally, everything was painted. The teeth, which I printed and processed individually, were weathered and placed into the mouth. At last, I put the tongue in place. So, that's it. Our Venom case mod is done. Thanks to MSI, Corsair and Alphacool, who supported this project, 
And also special thanks to Zinto for providing me with all the filament that I needed to print everything. I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.